tomorrow morning, Tex McIver should learn if he will be released from jail or remain behind bars as he awaits a second trial for the killing of his wife, Diane, in 2016. McIver was serving a life sentence for murder, but in June, the state Supreme Court overturned that conviction. Joe Hinkey has a look at what we can expect inside the Fulton County Courthouse tomorrow. The last time Tex McIver sat in a Fulton County courtroom, a jury found him guilty of murdering his wife, Diane McIver, by shooting her. Guilty of felony murder. On Friday, he'll be back in court because his attorney, Don Samuel, filed this request for bond as he awaits a new trial. I, I would be at all surprised if Mr. Samuel, Don says, we'll give him an ankle monitor. Just let him be out of the system. Daryl Cohen is a former prosecutor turned defense attorney. He is not involved with but has closely monitored the MacGyver case. Cohen says MacGyver being 80 years old, having no criminal history before his wife's death. It feels great to be out. We're going home. And the fact that MacGyver was released on bond before his first trial are all reasons he could receive bond Friday. But when MacGyver received bond in 2017 before his first trial, a gun and ammo were later found in his bedroom closet. A violation of bond and Fulton County County Judge Robert McBurney revoked his bond. Cohen expects prosecutors to remind McBurney of that Friday and argue against MacGyver receiving bond this time. He is a risk to violate any term of the bond because he did it before. And history tells us that you don't change a leopard's spots. In June, the state Supreme Court overturned MacGyver's murder conviction after finding at trial jurors should have been allowed to consider convicting him of a lesser manslaughter charge. In response, prosecutors have charged MacGyver with murder again, setting up a second trial where jurors will be able to decide between not guilty, manslaughter, or murder. After five years in custody, if granted bond Friday, MacGyver might head home for good. If he is found guilty of manslaughter, Cohen says MacGyver's time already served could possibly cover a manslaughter sentence. But if found guilty of murder, he would then head back to prison. In Atlanta, I'm Joe Henke, 11 Alive News.